This is the Bear Network. And the current time is 4.55 a.m. So good morning, everyone. And now, without further ado, please rise for our national anthem. And now on the Boo Bear Network, let's start the day with some Boo Bear, it's a dog's life. And now on BBN UK, join Woody as he overreacts to a bunch of DVD openings in another episode of An Opening Lock. Hi, should I speak of a day today, isn't that right? Yes, it is. It is. Hmm, what can we do today? Hmm, I have an idea. How about we try taking over the world and use all other potatoes to cause world domination? Pfft, screw that idea, you just get yourself killed! Uh, huh? Mother! Programming on BBN is now sponsored by Smart Water. It is water that makes you smart. Drink up, glass! It's your lucky day today! Mmm! Delicious! Smart Water. Totally not the smartest water in the whole world. Game over, yeah! That was the single greatest commercial I've ever seen in my whole life. Let's never do that again. And now on the Boober Network, we go directly to New Marvel Show. I said, and now on the Boomer Network, we go directly to new Marvel show. Turbo Tastic! Okay, what the frick? Turbo Tastic! What the heck is that? Turbo Tastic! Okay, whoever you're, please get out of the studio. Turbo no. Tastic! Okay, we certainly apologize for what just happened there. A certain cat snuck in a turbo thing. Onto our studio. Get back here, you pickles! Well, we would certainly like to apologize for that turbotastic incident that just happened right there, and do ignore all the barking viewers in the background. Lily and Boo Bear are chasing piglets with cats over what just happened. So that being said, as now on the Boo Bear Network, we will go back to New Marble Show. <laughs> As now on the Boo Bear Network, we go over to the news. Move over, Willa! A new Joe is in town! And they aren't critical actors either. They are two siblings called Stella and Sam, and they're already hitting the top spot over on Kitty Max, 
beating out Wales Wildside in the process. Tonight's special report is on the young sibling duo that young kids can't resist. Not since that purple dinosaur, or that young critter collector, has anything captured the heart of little children like Stella and Sam. Why do you like Stella and Sam? Because they get along with each other. Because they get along with each other, right? This young sibling duo who got their start in books has fast become the attention getter at daycare centers. The star attraction at kids' parties. And they even hit the top spot on Kitty Max, beating out Willow's wildlife. I've never seen a phenomenon like Stella and Sam, and I have a perspective on phenomenons. It's got a mesmerizing effect a even on the, the most mischievous of to toddlers. The when these two speak, they stop, right. look, like and listen. La, 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 Some might happily sing along to the kangaroo la, 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 hop song. Hop, hop, hop till you drop, drop, drop. I can clearly see why kids love them. I mean, Del and Sam are so kind to each other. They don't fight. They teach about imagination and friendship and getting along. And that just kind of like appeals to kids. How come we're having a rainbow breakfast, Stella? Because it's a super sparkly morning. I have a feeling that we are going to have another Willow-esque situation over here. I mean, the 2020 and 2021 Willow craze was crazy enough as it is. When that show became popular, and merchandise of the show flew off store shelves. So I think with the way this is going now, Stella and Sam, related merchandise, will probably start selling out by Black Friday. If you think this is little kid stuff, you gotta nurse in common. Stella and Sam are big business. As we talked about on the JH, in Paw City, Toy Stores sold out of Stella and Sam merchandise. A DVD was the only thing we could find. This past year alone, and late last year, Stella and Sam have ranked millions of dollars in retail sales. Over 50 million in home video. They're on Kitty Max every day, and you haven't seen anything yet. This fall, Clover Springs based Kidswise, the makers of the touchpad line of toys, will soon be releasing a Stella and Sam toy line, which includes games, educational toys, play sets, plush toys, and even a talking Stella doll that says praises from the show. At the Paul State Toy Fair this February, Barrister Toy Stores couldn't wait to get it on the action. Lily Alexia, BBN News. Thanks, Lillian. And while we're on the subject of Kitty Max, there will be more news about the preschool channel tomorrow because they're still adding new programs to their lineup, such as the CBB show in the Night Garden, which will also air on me, CJ H, very soon. And in other news, there's been a series of ongoing traffic jams in Paul City. Cars and other vehicles were continuously backed up for some odd reason. We don't know what happened, but Paul City police officers say that they are aiming to get the situation under control. With that, this has been this evening's news report. Boo Bear is a Chihuahua who lives happily with his owner, but this Chihuahua is no ordinary dog. He does the crazy stuff like taking over his owner's computer to watch cartoons and playing Among Us with his dog friends. But he doesn't want his owner to find out. Boo Bear, it's a dog's life. Every weekend at 12pm on Boo Bear Network. Just a brief reminder that you can find them all over as the BBN News 24 7 channel. And with that, now on the Boo Bear Network, we now come on down to Happy Town. Uh, I didn't say Japanese play! I said happy town! Happy town! Why is that puppy time today? Uh, Lillian, I want you to take a look at what just happened there. What's going on? Oh no! Now, how much do you want to bet that's all in the work of pickles? <sighs> just show the item, please. No, what? I don't think I even care anymore. I don't care if the Vermont music is playing on the wrong channel. Yes, guess what? Get the idea that way. Pickles the cat. He 
Speaking of which, he was the one who messed everything up with those pendulum balls and stuff. So if you can't tell by the sound of my voice, I'm doing crazy right now. It's turns out you're drinking ice cold milk that even he has to fly. Well, I might as well get going. I'm thinking to head over to JH for hosting Toontown. And I think I'm just gonna... Well, you'll find out later. Well, it looks like Lillian drank some ice cold milk and was cuckoo crazy once again. Anyways, as now on the Boot Bear Network, it's time to advertise that. Get it? 